Okay, I'm going to show you how to um, um, add and edit your posts in WordPress. So here we have the Helping Hand Support and Advocacy website. If I go down here, uh, I'm going to log in. Now, um, quite often, WordPress doesn't have a meta section with the login, in which case you type out the name, your domain name, so in this case it's helpinghand1.com forward slash wp-login.php. So whatever your domain is, forward slash wp-login.php. However, in this case we've got a login. So I click on that and it's automatically we're going to do username and password. So I'm going to pause this while I put in uh, the username and password. Okay, so the moment I put in the username and password it takes me to the dashboard. Now as you can see here I've got uh, posts here, media, links, pages. Uh, I clicked on posts so it's given me a list of the posts that are presently there. Uh, for those of you who are just blogging and do not have a whole website made in WordPress, you do not go to pages. You're not building more pages. You're just adding posts and that's what I've set it up for you to do. So here we can either um, uh, edit, uh, quick edit, trash, or just view if I want to. So I can change the text here. Say if I wanted to change something, I would click edit. Wait for a second. Okay, recyclables. Is that spelled correctly? Probably not. Let's fix that. Recycling, that's not spelled correctly. Recycling, okay, what else have we got here? This is in the visual um, window. You can also, if you're comfortable with it, go to the HTML window, and this is where you can see where the, the picture, which I'm gonna show you how to do in a minute, and the text here. I prefer to work in HTML, but those of you who don't know HTML may prefer to work in the, in the uh, visual. As you can see, I have made the changes, I have corrected the spelling errors, and now I'm going to go over here and I am going to click Update. Let's see, thinking, thinking, thinking. Okay, let's go back over here. Uh, and now it's updated. So now what I can do is I can go and view the post. And there it is the, with the spelling errors corrected, which is what we like to do. I'll just hit the back button here and uh, here we are back again. Now if I want to add new, there we go, add new. And it's going to ask me uh, for a title up here. So I'm going to do um, one called um, um, Garden Clean Up af oops, After the Rain. And this is very much like a, like a Word document. You can uh, bold, italicize, strike out. You can, you've got, uh, you know, you can do quotes, you know, you can set your uh, text alignment. You can build in links. We'll show you all kinds of things like that. So just a moment here. Well, um, with all the rain this oh, spring, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause this while I type some text. Okay, so here I've got uh, some text. With all the rain this spring, the weeds are going crazy, tomatoes aren't growing, but the buttercup is in all its glory. You need some help doing like garden cleanup? Are you out of town on holiday? Word, word that your garden has turned into a wilderness. Give us a call at blah blah. Okay, so now what we're going to do um, is we are going to add a picture. And I have already checked out which picture I'm going to use. So right here it says upload, insert, and here is where it says add an image. So I'm going to click that. And is it uh, in my computer? Is it uh, from a URL? Um, normally what I do is I go find pictures, I save them to my uh, uh, to my computer somewhere, and I, I and, and that's what I do. Um, however, you can do it from a URL, uh, and I'm going to um, put in the image URL. I've already looked this one up, so it's uh, it's not I'm not just channeling this. All right. 
I've gone to a site uh, called sxc.hu, which is a free and royalty-free source of photographs. Uh, some of them are free, some of them are paid, some of them aren't so good, some of them are great photographs, and I use it uh, frequently. So here is a uh, right-click, and I'm going to paste the URL of uh, where the picture is, image title. Oh, it's not letting me do that. I don't know why. Okay, what else can I do? Um, one moment. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the site where I found the picture, which is a stock exchange. I'm going to um, actually find the picture and I'm going to right click on the picture and I'm going to go save picture as and it's going to allow me to pick a place to put pictures save all right okay so for some reason um, WordPress doesn't like this probably because of of the name whatever it doesn't matter I have found a picture, I have saved it to my computer, and it's going to allow me to select files. So I am now going to go to uh, my documents, my pictures, and there we go, there's that picture right there. Now this is a really big picture, this is going to be interesting to see what happens. Because it's way bigger than we actually want for this blog. All right, so there it is. It's going to allow me, look how huge this is. It's uh, uh, 1,024 pixels by 768. This program allows me to edit the image. So let me see if I can do image crop scale image. You can proportionally scale the image. Let's make it um, um, 200. And it automatically does the other dimension for you, scale. In a blog, you don't need a picture any bigger than um, than 200. Save. All right, image is saved. So here we go. We're going to change this to Creeping Buttercup. And the alternate text, which is read by people who were sight impaired by their by their um, uh, text readers, Creeping Buttercup. Caption can be Creeping Buttercup. We're not going to do a description. We're going to do... Um, oh, isn't that interesting? We told it to be 200, but it's only giving us um, uh, the choice of medium or thumbnail. Well, let's try thumbnail. What the heck? Insert into post. Wait a second here. Let's just move this up so you can see it. Oh, it's not going to happen. So insert into post. There we go. It's cropped it, but I don't really care. That's fine. It's done. Let's do publish now. Oh, one last thing that you cannot forget to do, which is pick a category. You could either do tags or categories. I've picked categories. Um, we want, this one's all about garden cleanup. So let's, you know, it could be garden waste, garden cleanup. Uh, we'll just leave it at garden cleanup. That's fine. Publish. All right. Now we want to go back to view post. And garden cleanup after the rain. There it is. Give us a call. Creeping buttercup. Nice little picture. We come down here. Here's where people will be leaving a reply. If somebody wants to leave a reply for you, I'm just going to hit the back button. And here we are back. If I now go to um, uh, edit posts, there it is, garden cleanup after the rain. I can add some text here if I want to. I could change the picture if I wanted to, whatever. Um, but uh, the other, the last thing that you want to do is you want to, when you're finished your, bl your, uh, your blog for the day, you want to log out. And there you go, back to the WordPress. You could log in back at this point if you wanted to. So now if I wanted to go back and see what the website looked like. All right, here we are. 
And if I want to go and check out the blog, here I am. And by golly, there I am. Easy peasy.